Welcome to Ether One. This is a game I know almost nothing about. Well, might might as well just be nothing. This is in the Unreal Four engine, which Unreal, if you don't know about it, has a really bad reputation of texture pop in. Which means anytime there's a loading screen or anytime you go into a new area, all the textures will look blurry as fuck. It's me. Listen, I, I'm sorry for the things I said earlier on. What? It's just, God, I really don't think you should go to that place. I, I, don't, I don't think they care. Not like they should. And before you think it, I know how it feels to want to feel safe, to want more. You know I do it. But, but, Jesus, do, do you know how they view you? Just another patient to squeeze money out of. Please. Don't go tonight. I'm freaking scared. Those subtitles loaded at like 12 times the speed as the actual vo vo uh, vocals. We teach, they restore, you remember. You will never forget. We can help them remember. Pick up a restoration information leaflet today. Keeping your fondest memories alive. Discuss the benefits with your local Ether representative. This is actually the sequel to, uh... To... To... Remember me. In the mid-19th century, advances in genetic and psychological sciences led to a series of astounding breakthroughs regarding the human genome. At the forefront of these experiments, the Ishin Initiative discovered and developed new ways of mapping the human mind, expanding the knowledge of our species. Game doesn't look bad. Hello, Phyllis. Right. There should be a register on the reception desk. So once you've signed in, grab the key card from the top drawer and head on down. You will need it to gain access to the lower floors. Okay. What? Okay, that's a pretty cool way to do that. Wait a minute. It is incredibly... Uh, huh. Okay, so name first? Okay. York. Say zero zero because fuck you. This is the Twilight Zone, bitch. What time is it? Twelve thirty five. There we are. There's a key card, it said. Where? Whoa. That's pretty cool. Oh, terrible things will happen, I'm sure. I'm in restoration chamber number three. Now, if you don't mind, would 
Would you be a dear to head on down? Hey James, I have totally set up the greatest prank to get McCarthy back this weekend. Especially after what he did to my sandwich last week. I found out that he always works late on Saturday evenings, usually on his own ma own on maintenance within restoration chamber number three. Hey, that's the one I'm going to. You're not gonna believe what I've cooked up. I replaced the fuse in the Rembrandt power box with the wrong type. When McCarthy comes to do the power check on the... What? On the power check on the chair, it's gonna be a- make a huge bang. He's going to be scared to death. Later we found out McCarthy, uh, died. This kinda looks like Borderlands. Kind of. Ether Solution 3.5 suspended due to insufficient data regarding health and safety ratio of positive and negative effects upon consumption is currently one to t one out of two. It's one for two. It is worth noting that the current positive effects have shown the intended outcomes of the experiment clearly. Positive effects are clearly stronger, more defined focus in patients as well as stronger cognitive skills. Negative effects, however, have shown serious problems to the consumer and in some cases causing further short memory loss. Great, I didn't, I didn't need more of that. Items can be placed her. <sighs> Great. Already. Fuck. Man. Bug testing. It's a thing. You should do it. Oh, I can sprint. Yeah. Better than unfinished swan already. Doo 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 da. Okay, that's a creepy noises. Pick up an item, put it down. Cognitive psychology. Oh, fuck you. I don't want to switch it. Think I heard this is some kind of puzzle game? God, it's bright. Jesus, normally I don't have to turn down the brightness. God, it's still super bright. Get stapler, get hole puncher, need 12 ballpoint pens, A4 paper, use stationery to write letters, use hole puncher to file letters, use... Use S, get stapler. What? Use S get staple. Goal puncher need twelve point uh -huh. Thing stapler to staple things. Use stapler to staple things, stapler to staple things. What the fuck is with this game already? A bell. God, the resolution on those is not super great. Oh shit. Clipboard. Fresher right. A bell book. Hello, patients. The birth of a new era occurred today. Patient Zero, whom we have been working with in our projection experiments, has brought forth some very interesting results. First, his ability to communicate telepathically. Telepathically. Although at his moment, this moment in time, it is akin to a babe's ability to wail at his mother. His telekinetic ability has shown small amounts of improvement, tiny movements here and there. We even witnessed a box move across the table yesterday. T the other day. Fascinating stuff, really. Really fascinating stuff. Double incident during R157's treatment of patient J205. Wasn't that a number I just heard? It's occurred to me that we must fashion a mental safety mechanic that will instantly secure the consciousness of a restorer. Speaking with Dr. Collins, we were able to define a way to obtain contain some of the restorer's subconscious mind after the initial projection, creating a defined and contained space within the restorer's own mind. Something we now refer to as the case. We are to think. In physical terms, I would say the metaphor of a safe would suit quite well. 
Space to hold the Ross and some restores. Okay, yeah. Uh, the English in this game doesn't seem very good, which is fine. Yeah, you don't you don't speak English natively. <laughs> Jesus. Uh. What? That's terrifying. I'm scared already. Where the fuck? Got it. Button. Uh. The fuck? So I'm a restorer or a restoree because I'm meeting a doctor. Its solution has shown significant improvements over its predecessors. There's currently a only a 20, 20 out of one chance of negative and detrimental cognitive effects will impair participants when taking regularly. Positive effects include superior long and short term memory, which direct, directly aids in reducing confusion and hysteria. The only major concern so far is how long the effects of the new solution last. I know this can have serious effects on the liver and heart, and I fear a long term subscription would induce similar problems with impatience. Man, fuck off. What's the point of a jump button if I can't jump over things? Keycard. You go. Marriott. Do I need a cassette tape? Cause that looks like that's what fits there. Pill pot. Awesome. Pete Hill Reserve. That was that pop in I was talking about. Dang it. Hmm. I'll have to look for something with Mary on the name. Now, stump, some stuff just looks super dark. And some stuff just looks fucking bright as all hell. Like, oh my god, it hurts to look at. Like, look how dark that looks, and look how bright all that other stuff looked. Don't put pure white in your fucking video games, please. Pure white is too much bright. I'm gonna turn this off. It hasn't happened yet, but I don't want it to mess up recording. That's Restoration Chamber 3, so don't go over there yet. The music started. Nope. Attention all staff. New restoration chambers with state-of-the-art projection chairs were installed last week. It is important to note that there are new procedures that will come with this technology. It is important that each and every one of you comply with these rules. We don't want any, another staff fatality. Due to bad projection, R157 has suffered severe hemorrhaging in the brain. This has resulted in a minor stroke uh, impacting our patient. You know, we do tell them not to leave the pre-designated path, to stick to the memory routes laid out for them. But do they listen? Of course they bloody well don't. And unfortunately, recovery isn't always an option. Once you experience the deep recesses of another consciousness. So she knows I'm here. I don't know. Am I? Am I? Do I work with her, or does she work with me? Like what? This resulted in a minor stroke impacting her patient's motor abilities. The investigation is stoned away, although evidence points to a fault with the cerebral component of the restoration chair. Patient one R one five seven is currently in the recovery chamber, and depending upon treatment, may have sustained damage to memory functions. Look 
how bad that text looks. I'm waiting for it to load in now. Now it just looks shit. Awesome. Not so great. Not awesome, actually. Go anywhere but the area I'm supposed to go to. It's how you play adventure games. Wait, 20th? A window into the minds of others and a tool to cure disease and illness. But it would be nothing without the likes of you. Okay. Thornton Jean, 219. I need the electrical input for the Rembrandt installation rerouting. You can access it from that terminal over there. What? Okay, saying over there doesn't really help. Female, British citizen, A, J2057. That's me? Migrated to the USA in her 20s, only to return to the UK about seven years ago. She still retains a British passport and has been confirmed to have been working as a teacher in Arizona for the past 30 years. Since returning, she is residing in the town of her birth, Pinwheel, Cornwall. I don't know if that's a thing, Pinwheel. I don't know if it's an actual thing. Like, a place. It sounds like a place. I can't read that. Restorers may only carry one item at a time. Only accepts 300A fuses. Do I have to switch the fuse? This is boring. Big red button. <laughs> uh, oh wait, I got a trophy. Rembrandt repairer. Uh, it's not a good noise. That do it. Right. Thank you for that. Always nice to get some help around here. Now, if you don't mind, I think it's time to take a seat. That's not how people move. I don't have a body. Is this what I'm trying to restore? My non-body? Okay. Our primary focus is to ensure that we clear this area of her mind from the plaque buildup that is causing the disease. In order to do that from within, we're going to need to use her own memories to reinforce the medical treatment she's receiving. Okay. Okay, so I'm a restorer. I'm going to fix that 69 year old lady's brain. I'm going to fix your brain, lady. Don't worry. We're coming for your brain. But seriously, those, this game is indie as fuck. Like, look at it. Oh, just clipping everywhere. Ridiculous. How is this even made? Oh my god. This looks pretty cool, though. It's basically Iron Man. I'm, to I'm always ready. Didn't really get a chance to say yes. Well, I said yes, but the video game character didn't say yes. Because then it would break my immersion. Oh, wait, I don't have a fucking body. Is this what her mind looks like? Oh, please tell me. This is just going to break away and I'm going to be somewhere totally different. You're going to fucking drown me. This is, this is Evangelion. Fuck you. This is Evangelion. You just stole this idea. You assholes. 
they make you drown to be able to actually do anything. This is gonna go great. Don't worry. Nothing's can go wrong. Nothing could go wrong. I mean, really. It seems like this might might be might be kind of a horror game. Horror game. More in a horrors of the mind kind of way. Like, oh geez, that's fucked up and sad. God, I fucking stop. Video games, stop having pure white in your games. It sears my fucking eyes. Stop. It was never a good idea. Jesus. Okay, listen up. You are in your case. You're probably going to come back here a lot, so please take some time to get acquainted with your surroundings. It keeps most restorers' sanity intact. For a short while, anyway. What? Whoa. That's pretty awesome. Is this the pause menu then, pretty much? I can clip my own head through here. Awesome. Motherfucking video games. This is Inception. So... The case is, I'm guessing, a place filled with the memories of the restorer. And the actual place you're in, the mind. Marriott. Okay, so I just need cassette tapes. Let me guess, are there 20 of these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, there's twenty of those. There's twenty projectors. There's a safe down here too. So R two and square both do that. Whatever. Let's go. Where do I start? Okay, I just start back there. Our sole purpose this evening is to track the memory and pinpoint its location so we can cleanse it of any disease present. Everything you're seeing in front of you is a visual environment pieced together from our client's subconscious mind. Okay. Barren wastelands or an abstract painting reimagined. It's all completely tangible. What? All I can see are brain scans of tissue degradation confirming my previous diagnosis of dementia. Both are incredibly important if we are to succeed and understand our client's needs. Now, if you just give me a second, I'll have some more details for you. Feel free to explore in the meantime. Yes, ma'am. I will do just that. This looks pretty nice, but, I mean, I think it's like four years old or five years old, this game. I actually have no idea. I'm pretty sure it's old, though. Old like the lady we're trying to help. Jeez, this motion blur, though. Devlin Mine. motion blur hurts my mind. Readings indicate that the central focus of this memory is located below you in an old abandoned mine known as Devlin. Entry 95D in our client's memory journal indicates that an accident occurred affecting them in a meaningful way. These places are fucking huge. I need to ensure that I remember the lock combination to Devlin's side entrance, but the warden banned any of us from writing it down. Miners eat from metal plates. Don't forget. 
Miners eat from metal plates. What? What the fuck? What does that even mean? You're an asshole. Okay, this is fucking... This hurts. A lot. To watch. Jeez. Video. Are you kidding me? Gameplay? Head bob. Fuck you. Yes. No head bob, please. Maybe that's the issue. Nope. Dear Mr. Harvey, as I'm sure you are aware, my client, Mr. H. Smith, is intent on offering you a particularly generous buyout of the Harvey and Co. Limited Enterprise. We like to produce, propose a meeting between parties and solicitors on the 15th October at our offices in Devlin to discuss a potential acquisition of assets and trade. Be under no illusion, Mr. Harvey. We are fully aware of your current financial discipline disposition and are incredibly interested in rectifying this situation for you. Yours sincerely, Mr. J. Dawkins, business solicitor and consultant. What secret does the lighthouse hold? Our beloved Field Cider. May cease production upon the end of May Day celebrations. Mr. P. Field, who soon might not be able to continue with his labor pending a U.S. export deal, wanted to share some words. Thanks to you to all who have supported me during these tough times. No health and safety mining laws to come into effect soon. Be sure to check with your mining warden to get up to date with the new laws for your safety and the safety of your co-workers. I don't even try anymore. Just doing random fucking voices. Because I do what I fucking please. I do what I do. What is this thing? That is not something you'd see in a mining place. This is supposed to be like the 20th century? You're ridiculous. Shut up. You're lying to me. God damn. I'm so confused. There's too much in this game. Jesus, the motion blur is out of control. I have to pick that up. Bronze plate. Miners eat from metal plates. I see. Oh, I see. 1670? So 1670. What? Weird. Monday. I remember waking up here for the first time and feeling sad. For a long time I couldn't understand why I was here, but, but then I remembered smelling perfume. For the first time I was happy, but I'm not sure I know why. Saturday. A uh, today. A uh, nurse. Saturday is a day. Today, a nurse was holding my hand and asking me to calm down. I tried to explain that I had spilled a cup of hot tea and burnt my arm. The pain was terrible. The nurse shushed me and told me my arm was fine. And when I looked down, I saw that I was wearing a bandage. The nurse explained that I had an accident on Thursday. And I hardly heard a word she said after that. Somehow I had managed to lose three days. God, this game's super boring so far. What is that? Is this even a video game? Like, really? I think we all know the answer to that. Of course it's not. If I'm not shooting something or murdering people... Am I really playing a video game? The answer is no. Okay, so I've been digging a little deeper into our client's personal history, and I found details 
sort of strong emotional response to someone who once worked within the mine. Let me guess, it's going to be a male? The entry that discusses the mine at great length, but doesn't discuss whom the individual was that worked there. Continue to work your way down, further into the mine. It seems the center of this memory is very much at the heart of these industrial ratways. I'll contact you if I gain any more information. That was a super easy puzzle as well. Fuck. Okay, good. You're not going to make me read all those. I wish that L1 thing was just held down at all times. Like, it would always identify things, no matter what. Mr. Moran. Mr. Moran. Mr. Moron. It's come to my attention that during my inspection of the mining facility here at Devlin, the many of the workers in the pit are unsettled, uneasy, and as a result, unproductive. There is currently a correlation between the pitiful working conditions that these men have to endure and their motiva motivation to do productive and worthwhile work. Lifts and descent devices are, cur are clearly in disrepair. Ventilation in the chambers below are blocked, causing fume and smoke buildup. We, with these issues and more in mind, it is with my sincere apologies that I have decided that Devlin Mines should close temporarily until these issues meet the standards required by your governing union body. Man, fuck unions. They were useful. They were useful in the past, like they were actually needed. Now they're just assholes. Now they're just fucking assholes. Who are super selfish. They've become the very thing they strived to eliminate. Fucking money grubby bitches. I mean, yeah, some. Some are okay. I can say that, but spanner. This is fucking English as shit. Call it a spanner. Call it a spanner. Oh god, I am such an idiot. I borrowed the air compression manual in order to make repairs in the mine, and I let it down. Let it Left it down past the blast doors. Steve has warned me so many times about being forgetful. I just hope I can get it back before it gets lost forever. I can't afford for any of my wage to be docked this week. I'm guessing that person is the important person that we need. It's Fuck you, I need the spanner. Take it. And you have no use for it now. Case. You can always store it in the case and collect it at any time. Man. Man. Poop. That is some bull magic bullshit. Of course she fucking mentions that, so now I'm gonna bring every single item I've ever seen in any fucking area. Can I just bring like 1,200 fucking... Why can I only carry one thing then? Why don't you just make it so I can carry multiple things and I don't have to fucking do this? It always resets my fucking... <laughs> Excuse me. I burped. It always reset. <gasps> oh my god. I, that was a hiccup that time. For fuck. For fuck's sake. Henry's raisins. Raison d'etre. Of course, Henry's raisins are going to be extremely important to the main plot in this fucking video game. Put on some music, put on some jams. We're gonna party tonight. 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 Fletch. Fletch. Fuletcho, Fuletch-san, Fuletchini, Fuletchano, Fuletchocho, Fuletch the Detch, fuck you. Those inventions breathe fresh air into pinwheel. Boop. Uh huh. Preparation for pinwheels made as operation Father D. Wolfenstein. Father D. Wolfenstein. We'll be holding a special service at Pinwheel Church. The service will commence at midday and will include. 
With the ringing of the bells. Fuck it. All hopes on U.S. export deal. Hundreds of jobs. Red risk is the local tin and arsenic. Export quantities lower dramatically within the European. The territorial hopes depend on the successful closing of a U.S. export deal that would secure the company for a foreseeable future. Goes your pinwheel. Industrial would have devastating consequences on the small mining town of Pinwheel, where the economy relies greatly on the exports of tin source and a consider. God, I fucking don't like this game yet. It is the type of game that is just Oscar bait for video games. Equilibrium is always a good thing. Please sure all valves are in correct position. Fuck you. Well, damn it. Thought everything was just gonna fucking explode. But, well, shit. I hear calling as we work the ground, crying and begging for us to stop. Pleading and bargaining as we bring our tools down onto the earth. Rock and metal beneath our feet. Her waves are crashing against the cliffside in protest. Cursing our industrial ventures, crying for her plight. I know in my heart that one day she will lash out and we shall pay the price. But what can I do, Mother Earth? I have mouths that I need to feed. A job that I need to do. The industrial man asks of me and I shall provide. As the machines brim with repetitive life and the crafted tools claw at the rock face, I feel the unrelenting force of nature below me, making its preparations to unleash its freeform glory upon us. What a fucking hippie. Air, right. Exhaust, left. Equilibrium, left. Steam, right. Furnace, left. Why is this so shiny? Get me out of this water immediately, please. Oh god, get me out. Thank you. Okay, <laughs> where's furnace? Furnace. Okay, furnace. Can I just... Left. Right. Left, left, right. Right? Left, left, right. Right? Left, left, right. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Sure. That's good. Got it. Uh. I see. Jesus. How much you want to bet there's going to be something in that area over there that was... Stop making scary noises at me. I don't like it. Huh. Jesus, stop. Get me out of here. Oh, it's dark. Huh, it's dark. Huh. Oh, God. Huh. Sights and smells can help store memories forever. Hmm. A projector. I'm not sure how they got here, but I think they relate to our patient's history. Don't worry. You won't need these to progress this evening as they're an optional task. But we should at least give this one a try. 
so they're not optional. At least not this one. The bloody air hose is clogged. It's been clogged up again, which means I'm gonna have to puncture a hole in the rubber pipe to clear the smoke up down here. I don't care how I do it. We had to seal the lower mines off to stop the smoke spreading. It's hell for the miners, and it's and even though it's not ideal, it will have to do for now. What a dick. What a dick, this guy. Uh, are you gonna explain to me how to do fucking projectors? Things we touch throughout our life can stay with us in the back of our minds. I mean, I wish I could fucking read that. Isopropyl ethyl theonacarbamate. Theonacarbamate? I have no fucking idea what that means. Note from Dan. Dan, I can't find. I'll store important notes like this downstairs in the case for you. That's pretty cool. They'll be there whenever you want to have a look at them. Note from Dan. Dan, I can't find the air. Com that's not note from Dan. That's note to Dan. He's saying Dan, as in Hey Dan. His name is Steve. Fuck English, God. Find the air compression man manual anywhere, which means we can't get the door to budge. It must be around here somewhere. You were the last one to have it. Could you please find it and place the air on my desk? Fuck, how do I find... Like, what do I do with that? Something ain't right in the mines today. A man can sense when something ain't right. It stinks up in the air, making us sweat. I heard someone say they were gonna close the goddamn mine down entirely. The air compressor keeps breaking and we have no manual to fix it. We need a way to cut the ventilation pipes, otherwise we'll suffocate down here. Guys, I'm trying to do a different voice each time. Don't get mad at me. Please. Smush things. Put your hand in there. Put your face in there. Put your face in the bomb. We slink and stir throughout the night, lurking through the unknown. Relish in the place where only children dare to go. Dank alleys and secret fields navigated with the aim of reaching our adventurous and illuminated destination. Hiding from our foes, a lamp and toe. That guy really likes, like, fast. Like rhythm and stuff, you know. You know how it is. Is that supposed to be a canary thingy? Rubber pipe. Stab it. Wow, there's like fucking nothing in this area. The one area where there's like nothing. I'm just like, wow, this sucks, dicks. Oh, also a rubber pipe. So, maybe that... It can't be that that case thing has already become an issue. Uh, guys, I'm trying to go to the case. Guys, it's not letting me go to the case. 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 Huh. This isn't good. Did I break the game? There's no way I broke the game already. One hour, eight minutes already? You've got to be kidding me. Huh? The fuck do you mean? This game is broke. Are you kidding? What? What the fuck is happening? What the fuck? This keeps forgetting that it's on. I 
can't get back to the case. God, this game is falling apart as what the fuck? What is going on? Huh. I don't like playing games that scare me. I'm more terrified that the game's just fucking broken. Huh. Huh. Uh, I'm fucking terrified. I broke the game. Already. How? How? How did I manage to break it already? It's been like an hour. What? Shove your fist in it. <sighs> what the fuck am I going to have to do? <sighs> I'm not going to be able to finish this game, are, am I? Because this game's fucking broke. I think it froze on the loading screen because usually that thing in the bottom right is spinning. Did fucking freeze. I, I it can it can't have frozen, right? It's just taking a while to load. Okay, pl please, please don't be frozen. Jesus fuck, it's frozen, isn't it? This game's frozen. The game froze. I refuse to believe it's just taking a super long amount of time to load. I don't think I'm going to do this game again. I think I'm, I, I might try and play it another day alone, not streaming it, because holy fuck, it doesn't. For what? What? Wow. Plot twist. The game actually didn't break. Well, it broke. Please don't tell me I have to restart everything I did. Please. Please, God. See, look. It's actually spinning and stuff now. If you can hear what I'm doing, I'm kicking. I'm kicking something. If you can hear what sounds like a box being kicked, I'm kicking a box. So. Eh? Eh, pressing triangle still does nothing. Great. Fucking great. God damn it, video games. God damn it. Did I, I fucking broke the game. Fucking, what are we? Three out of three months where one of the PS Plus games is broke as hell in one way or another get your shit together oh my god it is not hard to find any of these bugs that I've run into they're super easy to replicate too if they are truly bugs and apparently I'm gonna have to start an entire new game so I'll see if they're bugs anyway fuck though
Look at this. Uh, I'm sorry. That's disgusting. Why did I do that? I apologize sincerely. I burp. Burped. People burp. People poo. Everybody poops. Everybody burps. It's normal. Man, I'm done. Or lady. Man or lady. I'm done. Sorry, Gene. You're gonna have to continue on with your fucking dementia life. Have fun. Well, that's it. I'm out. Dog. Son. See you later. Another day. Another dollar. Man, fuck. It's doing it again. Whatever. Spare you the 17 years. Where, uh... Where I wait for this. And that octagon over there fucking yells at me. Tells me to get a job and get a better life. And I tell him, fuck you. Get a better game. Bye-bye.